Hello everybody, today in Cooking with Mike, we're going to make the hugest sandwich in the world that certainly will satisfy all your hunger. So, let's make it. Okay, so to making this recipe you will need one red tomato, some bread slices, the cheese that you want, a bit of turkey ham, a lot of veggies and a little bit of McCormick mayonnaise. Okay, firstly you need to clean all your vegetables. Um, you will need to use a lot of soap to clean your tomatoes and your lettuce. Starting with the red tomato, making circles around all the fruit. Okay, with the lettuce, I recommend you to clean leaf per leaf. Next, you need to cut the tomato, but be careful, because if you cut it in chicken slices, the taste of the bread will be gross, because the, the bread will turn wet, and you don't want to eat a wet bread. So, cut it in good slices, like this kind and continue with the recipe. Now, you need to put two slices of bread in the oven. You can leave them for, for all the time that you want. Just for have this presentation that everybody loves. But be careful, if you forget to take out the bread of the oven, the bread will turn black, and that isn't too good. After taking the bread out of the oven, you should spreading a slice of macaronic mayonnaise in the slices of bread. Just a little bit to have good flavors in the sandwich. And obviously you can use another creams like mustard or maggie, but it depends on your... Now, Put all the lettuce that you want on one of the bread slices. After that, you need to put the tomato slices on the lettuce. Why not on the lettuce? This is because if you put them on the slice of bread, the bread will turn wet and this is very gross for the mouth. So put on the lettuce. Continuing with the recipe, uh, Select the slices of cheese that you want and put on the tomato. After that, take like one to four slices of ham. I selected turkey ham. Yeah, like sleep, like a book on the cheese. So, finally, put the other slice of bread on the ham. Put the rest of the lettuce like this. Take it out of your table. And now you have the hugest sandwich in the world. So this recipe is made for all the people that want to have a good meal with his family, with his friends and all of that. So I only wish for you that you can have a lot of joy eating this huge sandwich. Have a nice day.